Today, we are visiting the home of Stephen, a Sound of Art client who has bought not one, not two, but three different artworks from us. It's a pity he can't be here to join us today, but he's given us access to his beautiful apartment. I can't wait to check it out. What about you? Come on in, let's take a look. When it comes to interiors, Stephen particularly likes the British colonial style. He specifically told his designer to recreate the interior decor of Singapore's iconic Raffles Hotel. We think it looks absolutely on point. It almost feels like I've checked into a Raffles Hotel suite. It's a style characterized by sophisticated classic dark woods and a creamy white palette, coupled with a juxtaposition of traditional Victorian details and local Asian elements. He says he views his home partly as an art gallery. Of course, the art he buys has to visually enhance the space, but to Stephen, it's also really important that the art has a deeper meaning and a personal story behind it. He really enjoys sparking conversations with guests when they come over through his artwork. He felt that it was a worthy cause to support because proceeds from the sale of the paintings were going to be donated to three different beneficiaries. In the end, Stephen decided to not just get the leopard painting that was featured in the papers, but he wanted to get a trilogy of animal paintings by the same artist, Erica Wee, who is pretty renowned for her wildlife art. This is the first piece of art called On the Lookout. This is a leopard painting that first caught Stephen's attention in the Straits Times. It is absolutely phenomenal looking at it in real life and up close. What a striking piece of art. So it's been cleverly used as the centerpiece in the living room. And it's been placed above a fox fireplace. And that really makes it the focal point of the living room. Very, very striking indeed. The monochrome colours of the painting also match the interiors of the home really well. This is the second piece titled Earnest Intentions. It was also one of the artworks in our COVID-19 fundraiser sale. This is the last artwork, a lion painting that was specially commissioned by Stephen. This lion was actually inspired by the character Aslan in C.S. Lewis's classic novel The Chronicles of Narnia. In the novel, Aslan is a Christ figure and he is all at once majestic and awe-inspiring, strong and loving, all at the same time. Stephen says that this special look of tough love from the lion motivates him to work harder in the study. So it's perfect to be placed here. I hope you enjoyed this peek into our collector's home and his art. Thank you so much, Stephen, for inviting us in. I had an amazing time. So if you like this video, remember to double tap, like or add a comment. I'm Dawn from Sound of Art. See you next time.